this question is taken from elasticity of demand and supply you can see here if the price of a commodity falls from rupees 80 to rupees 50 okay first uh, rupees 80 and then it becomes rupees 50 so this one is initial price and this one is new price quantity demanded when the price of the commodity decreases, definitely quantity demanded will increase so you can see here quantity demanded for a commodity increases from 100 units to 160 unit before when the price is rupees 80 demand is 100 unit and the when the price decreases from 80 to 50 quantity demanded increases from 100 to 160 what is the price elasticity of demand here we have to find out price elasticity of demand so let's take a start solution initial price initial price p is equal to rupees 80 so at first price is rupees 80 and then became rupees 50 so new price new price p1 is equal to rupees how much 50 so first of all we have to find out change in price so here we have to write down change in price which is denoted by del p del p is equal to p1 minus p new price minus old price so p1 is equal to 50 minus 80 when you subtract we get here minus 30 similarly quantity demanded increases from 100 to 160 so we have to write here initial demand initial quantity demand or initial demand as your wish you can write anything uh, q is equal to 100 unit and new demand when the price decrease demand will increase so demand new demand is equal to how much q1 is equal to 160 unit so we have to write here 160 unit so how much change here so we have to write down here change in demand change in quantity demand or change in demand which is denoted by del q is equal to q1 minus q q1 is equal to 160 so write 160 minus q is equal to 100 so 100 write on when you subtract we get here 60 after this 60 unit now we have to use formula of price elasticity of demand and find out price elasticity of demand now we know that ep ep means price elasticity of demand and the formula is del q by change in demand by del p change in price into p by q so change in demand is equal to 60 right on 60 del p means change in price how much change in price minus 30 so right here minus 30 into p what is the value of p initial price 80 so 80 we have to write down divided by q q means q means how much initial quantity which is equal to 100 so we have to write here 100 okay up to here after this just calculate 00, zero cancel 00, zero cancel and when you calculate this we get here minus 1.6 which is your answer hope you understand this question taken from elasticity of demand and supply if you understand please hit the like button and if you're new on my channel please consider subscribe and do not forget to share with your friends thanks for watching till last keep supporting and keep sharing